This police officer of Scottsdale is a rapist, a pimp, and he is also a part of the gang stalking program. This incident took place on April 9th at 10.32 p.m. He performed a fake pullover on this date here. The same night that I was raped at my hotel. They pulled right over in front of me as soon as I was crossing the street, I had to pause so that he could cross the street. He pulled this person over right here in the same area. And this is him, same police officer. Same dirty rapist stalking and monitoring me no matter where I go. This is a completely different location where this happened just a, a couple of days ago. This is the fake pullover. This is a license plate on his vehicle, the one he was driving that night. This is the next incident of him stalking me and following me. This is the day that I was raped. I'm on the elevator getting ready to go out to find me something to eat, leaving the hotel. I'll speed it up. I go around to the front of the building of the hotel. And when I get around there, I just kind of hang out just to see who's gonna follow me out because I'm always followed out of the hotel. So I get around to the front of the hotel. I'm just kind of hanging out there. You got people over the Circle K watching me and monitoring me. And people hanging out at the front of the hotel. It just popped in. I'm standing there for a little bit. This white SUV comes through. From the back. From the back. And then boom. From the back. Now I'm gonna speed up my events. I'm coming from the back of the hotel. I get around to the front of the hotel. I post up just to see what's going on. And then this police officer from the Scottsdale police comes rolling from the back. Bam. And this is on, like I said, June 1st, 8 p.m., the day that I was assaulted. And the other Scottsdale police who rolled into this parking lot because they knew that I was walking through on the 28th at 6.14 p.m. Right up that way. I'll try. Right there. Right there. So this is the next night, let me look at the date. This is uh, June 2nd, the night after I had been raped. At 3.47 in the morning, I had just come back into my room. I was setting up the, the window, making sure that it locks and setting every, putting my security up. And he rolls through, pauses here. You can see him there with his light shining. Let me pause it for you guys. Let me try to zoom in. You can see him right there. He's got his uh, uh, spotlight on. And then he moves through. You see the lights? There he is. 